Hi there. It is March 30th, Wednesday. Um, today for school is, it is asynchronous, which means it's all online. And that means I'm here as a fly. Um, and I slept in and now I'm doing homework in my pajamas because I can't. Um, it really reminds me of when um, school first started back up after we had a quarantine. It was all at home, so the teachers told us to bring our stuff at home. I mean, granted, then I changed every day because just to make your routine so I wouldn't get, like, sick of it. And since it's just one day, I just decided to do it in my pajamas. I told myself I wouldn't change um, out of my pajamas and finish getting ready for the day till... I finished my homework so I have only chemistry and math left but right now the way math is going I don't know how <laughs> I'm struggling like I had math class yesterday and I understood it but now that I don't know I'm just struggling on figuring out how to do it like I even have a sheet like, it's like a cheat sheet, so I know how to do it, but I'm still, like, struggling. So I don't know if that means, like, I don't know if that means just because I was gone or if I just do stuff better when I know when someone just, like, reviews it all over with me or something. But I'm really struggling. We're just doing, I don't know what we're doing. Actually, I do know. I just don't want to explain it to you because it's, like, a lot of extra work that I do not want to do. <laughs> do you want to see my view? I'm going to show you my view. So it's my desk. I have my math, a notebook, my computer, which turned off since I'm talking, plants, the window, which I place my phone, and just stuff. What I think I'm going to do is do, like, a kind of time-lapse thing while I do my homework, because maybe that'll make me get it done faster, because I know... Especially like with cleaning and stuff, doing a time lapse definitely helps. I mean, I don't know how much it's going to help me learn, but like maybe it'll put me more in a focus mode instead of a panic mode because I don't know what I'm doing. So I'll definitely try that. So. I have yet to finish math, but I did finish chemistry. I am getting stuff done. If I'm going to be completely honest, I'm just looking at the work and I'm slowly starting to understand how to do it. I think I just need to go through the problems like the step says. And when I read it, it'll just come back to me. I don't think if I had a test right now, I would do very well. So that's a good thing for practice. But besides for that, it's going all right. So, yeah. I don't know when I filmed my first clip, but it is now almost two and I just finished my homework. So, yay me. So now I'm going to get ready and get changed. I called my grandma and she's coming over and we're going to be doing something because I don't have work and why not do something fun otherwise I'll just be watching TV which works but then again isn't as nice as social interaction sometimes. I'm getting ready now so I'll see you in a second. I just remembered I was recording earlier. 
so that's besides the point. Um, I forgot I recorded, but long story short, after I finished my homework, I went shopping, shopping, shopping. I went thrifting with, oh my gosh, I can't hold this, with my grandma. And I got ice cream. It was very good. And I got home, I ate dinner. I got a game on my phone and Alice and I were, were playing it. It was fun. And then I made TikToks. And now it's now and I'm like, I should really get in the shower. And I just want to show you how I'm sitting on the stairs. Um, like a normal person. Um, I'm just going to end this really random vlog that really had no purpose and is going to be super short because I forgot that I had it. Here's my lamp. My lava lamp. Sparkle lava lamp and my my flowers. And also, I got a happy meal today. It was fun. Okay, adios, chicos and chicas. I decided I want to end this video with more than just me being weird and crazy. So, I that looks really bad. One sec. So I decided I'm going to tell you about what I do before I go to bed. So normally I do this instantly, like right before I like lay down to, to like sleep. But I'm just going to explain to you what I do before bed. So normally I listen to, so I'm doing this Bible plan. It's um, the Bible in a year by Lauren Ebach. I don't know. It will take me through the whole Bible assuming I don't miss a day if I do it every day and after six days there's like a rest day and that's where it's just like a devotion or whatever so it's kind of plays with like the creation created in six days the seventh day is for rest so I normally listen to that on the morning on the way to school or before I get to the bus or something like that today since I slept in I did not go on the bus so whenever I don't do it in the morning I do it before I do this so I have the YouVersion app, so um, I don't really carry a Bible with me all the time, but I do have my phone with me, so what I do is I either read it on my phone or I listen to it. Um, I more so listen to it because that way, let's say I'm in the car, you know you listen to music in the car, that way I can just like listen to it. Um, and sometimes I do this first, but other times I do my journal first, so... I have like um like four or five notebooks or journals full. I don't know. I started in like 2019. Um like consistently in 2019 and I have only forgotten one day in the five, past few years that I've been doing it and that's actually been recent for reasons. Um and so what I do is I do the date, then I do the time, and then at the beginning I do the day that I'm writing it, like Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, or whatever. And then I just journal about my day. Sometimes I just say things that, like I've thought through the day, some things that I want to do, how I'm feeling. If I'm having a bad day, it's more about how I'm feeling, but otherwise it's about that. And then I always end it with like night and... I had a nice day kind of deal, so just wanted to let just say that I guess. So thanks for watching. Have a nice night. Bye.